Hey guys, what's up? Ian Fins here. And if you guys been wondering how to edit a multiple photos in your Adobe Lightroom, this will be the right video for you. So let's get started. The reason why Adobe Lightroom has been a very popular tool among the photographers is because Adobe Lightroom allows you to edit a lot of pictures in such a short time. So um, it's really important for some of the photographers, especially for those who are doing uh, wedding photography or uh, catalog photography because they need to edit a lot of pictures. So this software will allow you to save a lot of time. As you can see now, I have imported a few pictures on my Adobe Lightroom. If you notice that the pictures was taken on the same time and the same camera setting, and it is really important if you want to have a very consistent result. The first thing that you want to do is you want to adjust one of the pictures as your reference or as your guidance. So just select one of the pictures on your library. Then you can go to develop and adjust the color the way you want it. If you have a preset, you can always use it or you can always adjust it manually like I'm doing right now. And normally what I will do is I will adjust the exposure the way I like it. Adjust the contrast, I will bring down the highlight and the white color. I will bring up the shadow a little bit so I can bring up a little bit of the details on the shadow. And I will adjust the saturation of the skin color. You can go to the saturation and, and bring down the orange color. Okay guys, so I think I kind of like the way the color turns out. So the next thing that you want to do is you want to select all the pictures by clicking shift and select the first pictures and the last pictures. So if you notice that the Lightroom has select all the pictures for you and you can go to the sync button in here. And if you notice that there's a lot of option that you can click. So normally I will just leave it as it is, but you can always play around with it and just click the synchronize button in here okay guys as you can see now that lightroom has edited the rest of the pictures according to your reference so normally before i export all the images i will do a final check and what i'll normally do is i will go to the first pictures and select a right click and go to lock to second window as you can see now there's a small window pops up on your screen so you will use that as your reference to check the rest of the images. This is what I'm doing now. I am just want to check whether the color is correct or not. Yeah, it seems fine. Everything looks good. The exposure looks good. The color looks good. And for the last pictures, I think uh, we can make it a bit brighter. So you can just uh, adjust the exposure a little bit. There you go. And I think we get it right. Okay guys, so we are done adjusting the colors for all the pictures. The next thing that you want to do is you want to export the picture. So just select all the pictures and go to file and export. I'm just going to put it on desktop at the moment. And just to be sure that it's on 100% quality and 300 dpi for the resolution and press export. Okay guys, so in just such a short time, we have all the pictures ready on my desktop and it's already been adjusted. Okay guys, we are done and I hope you can try this at home. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up button and subscribe and I'll see you to the next episode. See you guys.